Okay, so your browser has been infected with this uh, key-find.com. It's basically a browser hijacker, and I'm going to try to get rid of it on all three browsers, on Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, and Mozilla Firefox in that order. So the first thing we need to do before we even open up any of the browsers is we have to go into the control panel to the uh, add remove programs. Now the thing is a lot of you guys um, keep going into your browser and taking out extensions and whatnot and it keeps coming back. Now the thing is if it keeps coming back and you're not looking in the right area on your browser settings then it's, a, it's actually an installed program and it's going to be in here somewhere. Okay. So from here what you want to do, now it's not necessarily going to be named uh, key find or anything like that. They can put it under different names, uh, numerous under names. Here's some of the names it's been under previously. So if you have anything that says, uh, anything, anything to do with the word uh, key or find, be wary of it. Maybe you want to uninstall it, get rid of it. Here's another one that other people had, what it was uninstall, installed under as is WPM. If you have like an IE plug service in there or a sub tab <clears throat> or anything with the words key or find and what else you can do is anything that's installed on a particular date that you think you got that um, until you, your brother started acting funny anything within those dates just uninstall it anyways the first step now a lot of you aren't going to have any of those in here because you're missing a step in your browser somewhere where it's actually not even installed in your computer. So I'm going to start with Google Chrome. Here's Google Chrome. First thing you want to do is on the top right hand corner you want to go to the Google Chrome setting. Click on up there and then we're going to go down to settings. And then from here we are going to go to the three places on this page here. Okay. Uh, it says on startup, open a, right down here you want to click on set pages. And here obviously you want to make sure you don't have key find on here.com. If you do, you want to exit out. Next spot, right below that where it says appearance, it says show home screen, google.com. You want to click on change. And from here make sure there's no instances of the key finder on here either. The next space, let me scroll down a little bit more and where it says search. It says Google here, you want to click on Manage Search Engines. Now if you see anything in here that's funny as well, what you want to do is you want to click on the X. Also down here, on this, down here. Anything that looks, uh, anything to do with Key Finder or something you're not familiar with, you know what, just exit out. You click Done, the bottom right hand corner, and now the last step, scroll all the way down. Then at the very bottom it says uh, show advanced setting. You want to click on that. Then we're going to scroll all the way down again to the very bottom. And we're going to do what's called a reset, reset browser setting. Now don't forget, when you, when you reset any browser, you're going to lose all of your favorites, your history, cookies, everything is going to be deleted. So take note, note of that. Once you reset it, close, reopen Google Chrome, and you should be good to go. Now let's move on to Internet Explorer. Okay, so here is Internet Explorer, and once you have it open, you wanna go in the top right hand corner, click on that little wrench, and now you wanna scroll down to, we'll go to Manage Add-ons first. From here, under Tools and Extensions, make sure you don't have any of that key find in here. If you do, you simply just highlight it, and then you click on Disable. Next thing you want to do is click on search providers. Make sure you have Bing in here as installed as the default. Next thing, top right hand corner again and go this time go into internet options. From here, on this tape, this uh, window here, it says uh, create a home page. Make sure your home page is set to the home page that you want. Next thing to do is click on advanced. And then look down here where it says reset. You want to reset this. Now don't forget, once you reset, all your history, your favorites, everything is going to be deleted. It's like you installing a brand new Internet Explorer. Once you reset it, close, reopen, and your IE should be good to go. Now let's move to Mozilla Firefox. 
Okay, so we have Mozilla Firefox open right here. And guys, don't forget, the always first thing you want to do uh, for this, um, this keyfind.com is you want to look into the control panel, make sure the program or the other names that I suggested are not in there. If it is, it's going to come back, guys. So anyways, even if you don't have it in the control panel, that's good. So it's, it's, it'll be, you just have a couple steps to follow in here in your browser and it'll be gone. So Mozilla Firefox open, click on the top left hand corner and you want to scroll down to where it says add-ons. Click on here. Look under plugins, make sure it's in, there's nothing in here with uh, key find or anything else that's suspicious. Go ahead and deactivate it or never activate it. Also, on the same page, you want to go under extensions. If it's in here, you want to go ahead and you want to disable it. Next thing is, go back to the uh, top left hand corner, we're going to click on down, and this time we are going to go to options. Now under here, under this window here, make sure your home page is set to the home page you wanted at. Next thing is we want to go to your search bar here and we're going to do is we're going to click on this little down arrow and we're going to go to manage search engines. Click on manage search engines. Now make sure you don't have anything that you don't want in here. Anything If key finder is in here or uh, key.find.com is in here, you want to highlight it and you want to remove. Finally, last and final step is you guys want to reset Firefox. Top left hand corner, click on the find. This time you want to go to help. And then we're going to go to troubleshooting information. Click on that. Now on this page on the right side, we see where it says reset Firefox. We want to go ahead and reset Firefox. Now don't forget when you guys reset any browser, you're going to lose everything. Your history, your favorites, your cookies, everything is going to be gone. All your download, everything is going to be gone. It's basically just like you uninstalling and reinstalling um, the actual browser. So go ahead and click reset Firefox and close and then open it up and you should be good to go. Any comments or anything, please comment below. If somebody finds it in a particular name in your ad remove programs, please comment at the bottom so other people know as well. Thanks and have a good day. Bye.